Hello, in this video, I'll teach you how to add a new node at the end of the linked list. So our output will look something like this. This will be the new node which we are adding and this will point to null and this is the required output. So let's see how we can do this. So the first step in adding a new node is first we need to create a node. So let's say node x equal to new node. So now we have successfully created a node and this is x and this has null. Now we have to make this node point to this node. Instead of having null value, it should point over here. This is what we have to do, right? So first we have to reach this node. How we will reach this node? We have head which is pointing to the first node. Using this head, we can start from here and we can traverse till the last node. And how we will do that? We will use a while loop, right? So let's say we have a node temp and it will start from head. So now we have a temp which is pointing to the same node which head is pointing. So it is also pointing to this node. Now we'll use a while loop. What will be the terminating condition? When temp reaches this node, you can see that this node's next part, this is what next dot next will have null then we have to break out of the while loop so i'll give a condition that temp dot next is not equal to null then you have to move by one node i'll say temp equal to temp dot next so using this while loop, we are making temp to move one node at a time and reach the last node. Once temp has reached over here, now what we have to do? We have to put this address in this part. So after this, I will say temp dot next equal to x. So when this line is executed, I am going to make this point over here. So this will now point to X. So we have a new link list and this node has been added at the end of the link list. So this is how you add a node at the end of a link list. But here we have one more problem. Let's say we have a link list which is empty. So head is pointing to null. What I mean is there is no node inside this link list. Okay, nothing is present in this link list. In that case, how you will add a node in a link list which is empty. So you just use one if condition. So in that case, you are going to create one node. We will check if head is null. If head is null, we are going to directly say that this node which we have created will be our new head. I'll just say head equal to x. So this is the first condition which we have to check. If there is no element in the linked list, we will create a node and make that node as the first node. In case this linked list is not empty and it has many nodes, you will use this approach. That is to traverse to the last node and in this last node's address part we are going to put the address of the new node and so that is all so if you learned something from this video please leave a like and consider subscribing my channel thank you